how the bank system is actually designed to work is to use each cylinder independently as you go. For example, if our SCBA bottles are at 4,500 PSI, if this bank system for this tank is at 2,000 PSI and the bottles are at zero, how it's designed to be used is you would turn on from this bank and fill those bottles up to 2,000 PSI or whatever it will allow it to be filled up to. Once it's at that point, turn this bank off. Let's say this next bank is at 3,000 PSI. You would then turn this bank on and then continue to fill those bottles up to 3,000 PSI. Once it's hit there, you turn this bank off. And let's say this bank is like this one is right now, just shot 6,000 PSI. You would then turn this one on, continue to fill 4,500 PSI. And then once it's hit 4,500 PSI, go ahead and shut off the system, close this down, release your uh, pressure on your valves and stuff like that. If you utilize the system like this, it'll just be more time in between having to fill the bank system instead of just using this one till it's under 4,500, then okay, don't use this one anymore, then fill this one till it's 4,500. If you use it in the bank system, how it's designed to be used, you won't have to fill these bottles anywhere near as much as you have to otherwise. So little by little, therefore you're not taking one full bottle all the way out so then you, at the end you could probably prolong it for another month before you can fill everything back up correct gotcha thank you